Hey, what's up you guys? I hope you're all doing well. Uh, welcome to the Mad Hatter Media Channel if you haven't already been here. Uh, my name is Clay and in this video we're just going to go over the new Android 12 beta that I have installed here on my Google Pixel. And uh, yeah, let's get right into it. Now first of all, there's a lot of cool and uh, new exciting things going on with the UI. It's really, uh, it's really fun and enjoyable to use. If you guys didn't already know, yes you can have the beta installed on uh, Google's devices. But I believe you can also download and install it on OnePlus, Asus, and quite a bit of other phones that aren't sold here in the US. Now first of all, getting right into it, you have the updated design on the lock screen with the updated always on display. I liked it before, but I like this even better. Now you guys may have already seen this as an excessive heat warning. Um, that's not for me, it's actually for you guys. Uh, that's just telling you how good this video is going to be. Anyway, let's tap on it. Now you can see we got a good amount of bubble action going on now. And yes, it's a little bit similar to iOS. And, you know, that's plenty fine because it's still different. But it still preserves that kind of happy and inviting element onto the OS. So you can head into your notifications via the arrows. View more of them all at once. And you can scroll down into your menu directly from there and that'll minimize your notifications. And as you can see, we got a pretty clean, but way different UI going on here. So this is the new drop-down panel. And yes, it's matching with my current theme that I have set right now. But if you didn't already know on the final release, it's supposed to uh, somewhat pull gradients and other elements of your wallpaper out and into your UI. So it's still gonna get smarter, but there's already a lot of difference going on here. Okay, real quick, let's get rid of this. Now, as far as the stability of this beta, um, it's been really good for me. Uh, I haven't had any stability issues, so far at least, and everything is continuing to run just fine as it should. Uh, another thing you guys will see is, if you can see as I brought the drawer up, it kind of had that uh, bouncing animation. Uh, that's new also as compared to before where it was just kind of that shadow that would pull up continuously. But now it's more so just this kind of playful bounce. So if I were to clear out all of these notifications and go back to the home screen, now like I said, the clock is over on the top left, but if you were to go ahead and swipe away all your notifications, it moves to the middle and the center and increases in size, it gets bigger. It stays just like that until you receive a notification again. So pretty cool little update with this. Okay, let's go ahead and give you guys a peek at the dark mode. See what that looks like. Chain it back. All right, so now I'm just gonna change the theme to show you guys a little bit more of what it looks like here on Android 12. Now, there are a lot more uh, features coming that will be included with Android 12. Uh, things like updated gestures, added features, uh, new updated face and customizability on widgets. So there's still a lot more cool stuff to come. But again, I just mainly wanted to give you guys a look at what the UI so far looks like. So I hope you liked this video and hope it also satisfied your curiosity a little bit. I will see you guys in the next one.